Hi guys, Thomas and Friends 47 here, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Trackmaster Cave Collapse set. Now, this set is a set that intrigued me when I first saw it, and I was so excited to get this. Now, I ordered this from Walmart.com, and I was able to get free shipping on the set because it was over $35. Now, this is the box that you'll see here. Lots of colorful artwork. Very nice. It's a very big box, too. I like how they showcase the characters. All right, and there's the quantity, or the items listed, rather. And then let's take a look at the set. Now, this is the set completed, and it's actually quite large. It's the largest Trackmaster set I've bought in a while. It does have a lot of stickers, which you'll see here, but I feel that they added the set, except for this one. I don't like this one at all. It just looks really weird. Anyway, though, let's take a look at how this set works. So the first thing is, you know, obviously with Thomas, we start him up and he goes down the line into this elevator shaft. And you'll see that uh, wheel there. And what you do is you turn that wheel and that takes him all the way up to the top. Now, this one thing that I'm a little, you know, not irritated, but not happy with. Now you'll see those boulders do fall and they actually fall into the cave below into onto the tracks. And that's where Darcy comes in. So Thomas goes down that hill, lands in Darcy, goes around the bend, and then right into that cave. And Darcy, with a spinning blade, this is the cool part of the set, spins those boulders right off the track. And then Thomas is ready to go. This is my problem though. Darcy stays where she is, which means it's a manual reset. You have to take, and then you gotta push her, push down, and then push her all the way back. And then actually locks into place so it doesn't move. Um, and then, of course, you know, you have to take and you got to reel Thomas back up after you put all the boulders back in. Now let's take a look at the characters that come with the set. Thomas really surprised me because this is just a stock standard Thomas. There's no special decorations, no extra details, nothing. It's just your regular run-of-the-mill Thomas, which was surprising and a little disappointing too. Usually they release something exclusive with the sets. But Thomas isn't the show here. The show is Darcy. Darcy is amazing. You can see how wide she is compared to Trackmaster Track. And she's powered, of course, by a Trackmaster engine. And the detail on the bottom, you can see all those switches and things. And that's what makes her, uh, you know, makes the front pop up to let Thomas out. You'll notice that gear there that spins the blade. And then the gears in the back power Darcy. The tracks on her look a little bit weird. I wish they would just left that plane but they actually gave her rail ties. Again, I wish they would have left that plane. You notice the track detail there. Now that's colored in, which is a shame, but uh, I plan on doing that myself. Then you also see it says Darcy on the side with the cap window and a viewer's observation on the top with a searchlight. The back here is kind of plain, but it's okay because Thomas has to run through. There's the other side. Basically the same as the first, and there's the blade spinning. All in all, my final thoughts on this set are it's a really cool set, and I like the idea of it. However, I don't like that you have to manually reset the, the items every time you want to play. Meaning that anytime you want Thomas to make more than one lap around the track, you will have to take back Darcy up, put her in place, and then if you want the cool boulder effect, you have to reset all the boulders, and then wind Thomas back up with the crank. I mainly got this set for Darcy, and after testing, I'm happy to say that you can use this without this set. You can have her run on just a loop, which has given me an idea that I'm going to be working on. I don't want to say too much on it, but you will see it soon. If I had to give this item a rating out of 10 stars, I would have to give it an 8. The set's nice, I just don't like the reset feature, but Darcy is incredible. She is my favorite Trackmaster model in recent history. So I'm excited for that. Anyway guys, this is Thomas of Friends 47 signing off. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you want to purchase this item, you can use the link below for walmart.com. Bye!